Welcome to the Bio Whisperer channel. Our topic today is on a perspective overview on animal biotechnology. Animals are playing a growing role in the advancement of biotechnology, as well as increasingly benefiting from biotechnology. New tools are provided for improving human health and animal health and welfare and increasing livestock productivity through animal biotechnology and when applied to animals such as insects, fish, and livestock, it helps address different concerns and enhances the ability to detect, treat, and prevent diseases. Furthermore, it assists in food production and in easing environmental pollution. Animal biotechnology includes all animals and livestock which includes poultry, fish, insects, companion animals, and laboratory animals. Combining animals and biotechnology results in advances in various areas which are impactful. Amongst these, we can see improvement in the food we eat which includes meat, milk and eggs. From the environmental aspect, livestock cloning improves animal breeding programs allowing farmers and ranchers to produce healthier offspring with lesser resources, giving mankind safer and higher quality foods more consistently. Other impactful benefits includes advancing human health with therapeutics and improved animal health and welfare. We can also see that enhancements to animal products with a sustainable note inclusive of environmental and conservation benefits. Animal-made pharmaceuticals transform biotech animals into factories to produce therapeutic proteins in their milk, eggs, and blood, which can be used in the development of biopharmaceuticals. These include production of therapeutic compounds such as vaccines, growth factors, and antibodies. Furthermore, biotechnology can be used to produce human-compatible transplant organs, tissues, and cells in pigs that can be vital to enhancing human health. These xenoderived transplantable organs can be vital towards enhancing human health. Xenotransplantation, which conceptualizes the implanting of organs from one species to another, is a growing field and scientific advances could help address organ transplant shortages. The procedure has stirred up conversation around ethical dilemmas, animal rights and ways to boost organ donations through other methods. In October 2021, surgeons at New York University's Langone Health completed a proof-of-concept experiment by attaching a pig kidney to a brain-dead human body. The organ continued to function normally for two days post-treatment, revealing the proof of principle that xenotransplantation as a strategy is viable. On January 7, 2022, a team of U.S. doctors successfully transplanted a gene-edited pig heart into a living patient with terminal heart disease. Xenotransplantation took another monumental leap forward with the successful transferring of a gene-edited pig heart which has been engineered to have 10 genetic alterations. They eliminated three genes responsible for organ rejection within the pig's genome while introducing six human genes to help the patient's body accept the new heart. Xenotransplantation is, therefore, an applauded technological innovation, but the benefits are not without concern and remains highly debatable if we are ready for this medical intervention strategy. Enhanced animal husbandry practices have been practiced for centuries with selective breeding to generate pure breeds with better quality animal products. Notably, modern technologies such as artificial insemination, embryo transfer, in vitro fertilization, genetic mapping and cloning add more tools to the arsenal for improving animal health through animal biotechnology. This result in healthier herds using animal vaccination practices, and given the availability of new diagnostics tests, animal diseases can be picked up early as well. As our understanding of foodborne pathogens increases, farmers can also perform dietary supplementation in animal feed to give rise to stronger healthier herds. Farm animals and their feeds have been improved through biotechnology to reduce animal wastes, minimizing the impact on the environment. Phosphate is an important element from animal waste can play a role in causing algal blooms in water bodies. These outbursts of algae rapidly deplete the water's oxygen, 
creating vast dead zones for fish and other aquatic life. The envirepig has been genetically modified in such a manner that its urine and feces contain almost 65% less phosphorus than usual. Canadian scientists developed a genetically enhanced line of Yorkshire pigs with improved digestion of plant phosphorus. Herein, a gene coding for phytase is introduced where the pig's salivary glands produce this enzyme to further assist in the breakdown of phosphate leading to lesser phosphate released. This innovation helps farmers comply with zero-discharge rules that forbid pork producers from releasing nitrogen or phosphorus runoff in certain countries within North American continent. With longer-term observation, the enhanced trait was proven to be stable for more than nine generations and that phytase expression was mainly present in the salivary glands, which enables the eco-friendly envirepig to be commercialized. This is also a proof of concept that it is possible to genetically improve animal traits. In another example of a biotech improved animal is the bird flu resistant chickens. British scientists have used gene editing techniques to stop bird flu spreading in chicken cells grown in a lab. This technology then has the potential to stop the global threat of bird flu in poultry production as well as in human health. Genetically modified chickens harbor a short hairpin RNA that work as decoy that inhibits and blocks the spread of the influenza virus. Further tests showed that transmission of the virus to both transgenic and non-transgenic birds was prevented. The findings raised the possibility of producing gene-edited chickens that are resistant to the disease though no live chickens are produced as yet in this proof of concept. Our Advantage Salmon a genetically modified or GM salmon were patented by Canadian scientists who took a gene that regulates growth hormones in Pacific Chinook salmon and a promoter segment which is the equivalent of a genetic on-off switch taken from an ocean pout and introduced them into the genetic structure of an Atlantic salmon. This modification gave the Atlantic salmon a year-round appetite enabling it to reach market size faster than other farm salmon. The Aqua Advantage salmon is determined by the United States Food and Drug Administration as safe to eat and as nutritious as food from other non-GE Atlantic salmon and there are no biologically relevant differences in the nutritional profile of Aqua Advantage salmon compared to that of other farm-raised Atlantic salmon. More improvements in the animal sector are expected in the near future and hopefully would reach the market to fulfill their potential benefits to humans and animals. Effective and responsible science communication among the scientists, government, industry and other stakeholders. Where necessary, debates and forum communication is desirable to achieve a consensus on the use of modern biotechnology in animals. I would thank you for helping to share your love for this science channel by clicking the like button and subscribe for future updates. If you like this video, please smash the like button and subscribe to this channel for future updates.